Hey, this is Brian with the HVAC School Podcast and HVACRschool.com. I just want to show you real quick and how the Testo 510 is set up, especially for measuring inches of water column, um, which is really important in the U.S. market. That's what we use for measuring static pressure on a system and for measuring gas pressure. So the first thing is you have your dual ports, you have your plus and your minus. Um, depending on what you're measuring, obviously, you know, negative pressure, positive pressure. Um, but in some cases, it really doesn't matter because it can both show positive and negative numbers. Let's show how it's set up. So the first thing is if you just press on, it's going to come on and it's going to be set in HPA as the standard setting for this Testo 510. If you want to change it to inches of water column, what you need to do is shut it off. So hold down the button until it shuts off and then hold down the button longer so you don't just hit it and now you can see that we have some options and so you hit the up arrow until you get to there's pascals millimeters of water column which is not what we want millimeters of mercury psi there inches of water column that's what we want for most of our measurements now if you keep going there's some other options for measuring airflow velocity but we want to go down to inches of water column. And you hit mode, then it's going to say auto off. I leave that on just in case you accidentally leave it on too long. You want it to go off automatically. And then you hit mode again, and now it's going to go in and read. Now, if you want to zero it out, what you do to zero it out is just hit this up button, and then it just zeroes out. And now, obviously, when you zero it out, you need to be zeroing it out with it in regular condition so in in the room uh, that is the kind of the reference point if you have one of these hooked up already and then you zero it out then you're going to read a, a vastly incorrect reading that's basically it when you're ready to shut it off you just hold down this button until it shuts off all right that's the testo 510 very easy to use nice little compact manometer you can find it at truetechtools.com use the offer code get schooled for an additional discount at checkout